What's going on guys, my name is Embrace the Pace and today I've got another update video for my 2017 offseason roster for NBA 2K17. I haven't done one of these in about two weeks but a lot of stuff has been happening to the roster and I'm going to go ahead and go through the entire thing in this video. I'll scroll through every team's roster, I'll scroll through the whole free agent pool so you guys can see everything and then I'm going to also explain to you in a little bit more detail some of the updates that have been happening. But before we jump into that, I do want to say a huge thank you to you guys for downloading the roster. We're up over 200,000 downloads right now and you guys have seemed to really be enjoying it. Um, so I hope you guys are and thank you guys for all the support so far. As far as what has been going on with the roster, obviously the biggest thing is all the transactions have been updated. Um, all free agent signings are updated, a bunch of new players were added, all contracts are accurate, everything like that is fully updated. Now, I've had a lot of people comment on videos telling me to, you know, update the roster, add this guy, add this guy, you know, move this guy to a different team. All that stuff is completely updated all the time and I don't make a video every time a move happens just because that's not really necessary and it definitely takes time to sit down and record a video and everything um, but everything is updated almost instantly there have been so many moves that I've gotten within the first 10 minutes or so from when the move is announced um, everything is updated every day the roster is uploaded multiple or updated multiple times a day so you don't have to worry about that but I do highly recommend that you guys follow me on Twitter. Every time a move happens, I'll tweet out a screenshot of the guy in his new uniform so you know when the roster is updated. I let you guys know about new players that are added, new features that have been added to the roster, everything like that. So make sure you're following me on Twitter. If you don't have a Twitter account, you can make one. It's free. It takes one second. Follow me on there if you want to stay up to date with the rosters. My name is Embrace Pace on Twitter. The link is always in the description. Go follow me over there to stay up to date with everything with this roster. Um, so with the transactions have obviously been updated, but a lot of other stuff has been um, tweaked and kind of polished as well. So there have been a lot of attribute changes. Not many guys have gotten overall changes, but a lot of individual attributes have been changed based on summer league performances and everything like that. I only do this for guys that I created. Um, I don't do this for guys that 2K rates because people get a little bit mad, you know, when I change ratings for 2K guys and ratings are so subjective. So I stay away from that and let you guys yell at 2k if you don't like a player's rating but a lot of guys that i created a lot of rookies a lot of summer league guys uh they have had some ratings altered based on their performance i've also updated hairstyles accessories um stuff like that for a lot of guys and there have also been a ton and i mean a ton of new players added to the free agent pool this is something i really want to let you guys know about do not overlook the free agent pool there are a ton of players in there that have been added. I've added in a lot. I also have some people helping me here and there um, from the community. They've added in a ton of players. So there is an insane amount of summer league guys in the free agent pool that you can add to the roster if you would like to. I actually sent out a tweet the other day asking what guys you would like to see added to the roster. And literally 90% of the responses were guys that are already in the roster and have been all year long. There have even been some guys that have been in my draft classes since literally September of last year um, that people just didn't know about because they just overlook them and they're in the free agent pool. So make sure you're paying attention to the free agent pool. There are a ton of guys in there. A lot of new guys have been added. Um, Two-way contract players, for example, Antonio Blakeney, he's in the free agent pool. Alex Caruso, free agent pool. Bronson Koenig, Derek Walton Jr. Um, there are draft and stash guys like Gershon Yabuselli for the Celtics. There are a ton of guys in that free agent pool, so do not overlook that. Um, I've had a lot of people helping me with that. A lot of people have offered to add guys in, so they're not all my creations, um, but they are you know, creations from the community, and I think you'll enjoy playing with a lot of those players. Like I said, some of these guys with two-way contracts, like Blake Neer Caruso, for example, I didn't add them to the actual team's roster. And I'm not going to get into how the two-way contracts work, but basically 2K only allows 15 roster spots in the game. And now with the two-way contract rules, teams have 17 roster spots uh, that they can fill. So I can't add all of these two-way con two contract guys 
to their team's roster but like i said they are in the free agent pool so make sure to take advantage of that and check it out i'll scroll through the entire thing in alphabetical order so you guys can see all the players that are in there and there are a lot of players being added um you know frequently throughout the weeks and everything during this off season uh, another thing is there have been new player models added for a lot of guys that 2k did not face scan um just some guys for example yogi Ferro, karis levert akaro white um, Rodney Magruder guys like that there have been a ton of updated player models and not by me They are also from guys in the community and I've shouted them out on Twitter There are quite a few guys I think there have been five or six people that have offered new player models that have offered to create new player models for guys um, So those have been in the updated roster. They're in the roster now as well um, So make sure you guys are you know aware of that and I think they look a lot better than the 2k creation so that's pretty much it for the updated roster. Like I said, this is updated multiple times every single day. Every time a move happens, I update it with the new contracts and everything. Um, so make sure you guys are frequently downloading the new roster, um, you know, for your My League or for Play Now games or anything like that. Also, one more thing I want to say, uh, just quickly, I get asked this all the time. I know that in the roster there is a period in between the C and the O in Dwayne Bacon's name. I used to have it spelled B A Q O N, and the reason for that is because for some reason 2K picks up the last name Bacon as inappropriate. So I've had probably 50 people so far tell me that I spelled bacon wrong and I didn't spell bacon wrong it's just that 2k will not accept it so that's pretty much it for this video I think that's pretty much it for what we're going to be doing for 2k17 we're pretty much wrapping things up now 2k18 comes out in two months and uh, we're kind of getting to the point now where free agent moves have slowed down a little bit uh, so we're going to be wrapping things up pretty soon I'll have news on the plans for 2k18 it's going to be a really really weird year next year i have some crazy plans it's going to be way different than it has been in previous years but i'm excited to share details with you guys uh, and i hope you guys are excited so we'll talk about that soon make sure you're following me on twitter make sure you're following me on instagram links will be down in the description uh, and i will talk to you guys later